for everything scary on GM Haunts. And today I am at my local Spiro Halloween for 50% off day. gentlemen, it is November 1st, 2023, which of course means that Spiro Halloween's 50% off sale for the 2023 season has officially begun. As you can see, it is the first snow of the year. Pretty fitting that it happens on November 1st when the 50% off sale started. Um, but without any further ado, I am here at my first local store. We're going to take a look at what they have available for 50% off day. Then we're going to take a look at my second local store, see what they have, and then stay for the very end of the video when I show you my full haul of what I got for the 2023 Spirit Halloween 50% off sale. So without any further ado, let's jump into it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we are inside my main local store. And as you can see, a drastic change. By the way, heavily snowing outside now, just like you saw in the intro. So very fitting um, for literally November 1st. But as you can see, a drastic change from what the, it was on, on opening day, obviously. The front ISC Jack's Mausoleum is now fully taken apart. You can see all the, the cardboard here, um, all parts of the mausoleum, and then all the display props as well are now out on the floor. Blackheart right here from the back theme. You have Slim Strawman, which actually was a, a placeholder towards the end of the season here. Betty Sharp, another placeholder, Howling Spirit. Uh, from the back I see who was a uh, who was set up later on and, and as you can see these are the uh, the displays that are left at this store along with some jumping spiders some of the weeds from the back theme but as you can see Jack's mausoleum completely uh, disassembled here no more roof really this is all that's left of the front ISE um, here in my local store so uh, pretty crazy to see this is all stores now Always what it looks like at the end of the season with the ISE taken apart is pretty crazy. Um, obviously you have all the shirts which are available, a lot of them. These are always kind of left for 50% off day. But there's the front ISE and all the display animatronics, you can see the boxes. Okay, now to me this is the craziest thing to see at my main local store for 50% off day, is the amount of animatronics left on November 1st. Normally, and I've been doing this for many years, there's like never any animatronics left. Look how many are left here, this is pretty awesome. Brand new slim in box, Pretty Woman Leatherface, obviously I do already have him, a Deadly Creeper from last year, two nozzles, the inflatable ghost is here as well, a man's possessed friend, two howling spirits, a poor George, but he does have broken motor, so he's already 50% off, a stilts, which, a little bit of a spoiler alert, stick around till the end of the video, I did get a stilts today for 50% off, but another two deadly creepers, brand new in box, the ghost face inflatable, Sam Groundbreaker, right here, a darling Dolly, who I obviously did get a couple months ago as well, but super cool to see her left, a Mr. Punchy from last year, but this one does look like a return because the box is pretty taped up there as you can see but still cool to see him on 50% off day and then another stilts I just cannot believe the amount of props that are left here for 50% off day and this is just my first local store I don't even know what the other one looks like so I'll take a look at that uh, in a second but look at all those props all 50% off now this is pretty crazy to see too the back ISC mausoleum row is not taken apart but as you can see completely empty um, um, with animatronics, no more jumping spider, no more Desmodus, everything's gone, it's super quiet. Just listen, no, no, nothing. It's the sad end of the season that we feel every year. But as you can see, Mausoleum Row is completely empty. Um, just the, the cardboard remains, still looks cool. But uh, that's really the uh, the end of the ISEs. We'll take a look now at the stock that is left because there actually is a pretty good amount here at my main local store that's left over. As you can see next to the back theme, we have all the lighting. A lot is left here. Black lights, mini strobes, uh, more black lights. This I actually have, the World of Motion Spider, the fog timers. All of this is left for the, uh, the fog and lighting section next to the taken apart mausoleum row. Some of the outdoor decor, I mean, look at all these inflatables all left here on November 1st. Pretty awesome to see that all this is 50% off. All these tombstones are left here as well, which is uh, pretty neat. A just really, really big assortment. I mean, even here, the new step pad cover set for this year. Step pads, which they're actually the new step pads that have the uh, improved technology on them. Here are the old step pads, the dropping spiders, the skull stacks are left here as well. Let's see, here's the, oh. 
batteries are probably dead at this point in the season, but all of this available on November 1st for 50% off. That is just crazy. Here we have some assorted tabletop items. I actually did get the Pretty Woman Leatherface Sidestepper, which was an item I wanted all season, and I finally got them for 50% off today, so that's pretty cool. They also have uh, some spiky sidesteppers left. Another one there, they have a Sam sidestepper left. Ghostface, new for this year. A uh, vintage Frankenstein sidestepper. More of the Sam ones. Also, the other Sam decor, which I know is popular this year. Again, all 50% off. Just like I said with the animatronics, like this is pretty insane to see this amount of, of merch left for 50% off day because normally there isn't. Um, down here, another popular item for this season, the Leatherface statue um, that has the same audio as the animatronic which has a ton of detail on it very very cool piece but uh, take a look at that i'll back up here so you can see the whole wall all of that is available on november 1st look i mean this massive assortment of hanging props is still available for 50 percent off day this guy is very tempting and he has been for many years but i don't think i'm gonna still pick him up but so many hanging props available all of these skulls these are actually the ones from reaper's island cave from 2020 these two the latex skulls this is the mutant one all of these are still here you also have the pumpkin stack for this year let's see no batteries are dead it's too late in the season but that's here some more hanging props another one that's very cool that's uh returning from many years now the barbed wire one but take a look at all of this you actually have the skull stakes are here right now just a massive um leftover i guess oh all the door covers are here as well still that one is awesome the leatherface one but all of this is still here we'll take a look over on this side with all the the body parts and such the hanging foot is here a lot of merchandise over here you have some of the leftover isc stuff of course the gargoyle a fogging gothic gargoyle from mausoleum row one of the trees another tree and another tree um all left over that weren't purchased yet so it's pretty cool to see the leftover isc stuff but like we saw in the beginning there's the uh the front theme with all the disassembled props and uh, the spirit paper is taking down. Pretty crazy to see. And remember when I was here for the opening day and when I posted my opening day store tour. And now the front ISC looks like that. And there is my first local store on November 1st, 2023 for 50% off day. Let's get one good look here in front of Jack's mausoleum. I should put like a side by side of what it looked like on opening day. And now all the taken apart cardboard, it stopped snowing a little bit, but look at that. The remainders of Jack's mausoleum. All right, so here we are at my second look with Spirit. Let's take a look. And here we are, store number two, my second local store. As you can see, the ISC at this one is uh, more assembled than at my, my main local store, but still being disassembled as we speak. I am kind of surprised to see that the archway props are, are still here. Pretty Woman Leatherface. I don't know if, I don't think they're still on, but here he is, still assembled. We have stilts, who I did pick up today, like I mentioned, for 50% off day. Very excited to, uh, to open him up he's still remaining at this store no more archway no archway sign no archway itself and then uh hell spawn display hell spawn here is left over as well so very nice to see him and then jack's mausoleum being taken apart the roof is gone a lot of everything is gone little jack harver is actually on the floor here which is interesting to see him being left over some tombstones but jack's mausoleum is uh a ruins just like the other store just like all stores across the country as you can see no poor George slim the display slim is still here uh, not on the riser anymore but he's still here they actually have three of them four of them actually there's one of these is probably the display box four slim boxes so probably three of them new in box for 50% off that's pretty insane like I said just like my other store tons of animatronics for 50% off this year but here's the display slim we'll kind of walk over to this side to take a look at the other props as you can see little skelly bones left over here nice to see him from last year a young crouchy display a Betty sharp display and a howling spirit just like at my main local store left over for 50% off day and then as you can see the animatronics let's see what they got a mr. punchy brand new in box this is not a return like it was in my other store two howling spirits two nozzles some of the uh, new for 2023 floor candelabras a hell spawn which is very intriguing 
for 50% off day, but I, I don't think I'm gonna do it. But still, very intriguing to see him uh, left over here. And then it looks like two of them, or th maybe three, there might be a third one right there. Stilt, who, like I said, I did pick up in my other store for 50% off. But cool to see him here. And then an Eternal Rest, who I don't think anyone's gonna be picking up today. <laughs> but still here. So there is the animatronic stock at my second local store. And towards the back of the disassembled Jack's mausoleum, we actually have, it looks like four straw man. That is insane. Look at that. One, two, three, four. Brand new in box straw man. That is crazy to see on November 1st for 50% off day, but they're here for straw man. And then this is the display widow that is still left over looking for an owner. Look at that. Her arms are even out. She wants me to buy her. But unfortunately, no, I'm not picking up the widow. But still, take a look at that. The roof is gone. She's out of her place. No more lighting. And then here's the side angle. Look at that. Jack's mausoleum completely taken apart. And now take a look at this. The back ISE mausoleum row completely disassembled. Uh, way more than at the, the last store. Look at that, all the pieces, the uh, front mausoleum walkthrough, risers, everything like that. The only thing still standing is the uh, mausoleum with the door, the jumping spider, and one of the trees. The green lighting, as you can see, and a black and red jumping spider, one of the only left standing IAC animatronics. So there's the mausoleum. I'm actually surprised this didn't sell because it's been selling at a lot of stores. 75 bucks for the whole mausoleum with the door is a pretty good deal. Um, it's a very cool piece. And like I said, a tree still here. Another tree over here as well from the back ISC. The trees are some of the most popular ISC pieces this year as well. Um, also the most expensive ISC piece at 250 bucks. Um, but take a look at it. All the cardboard completely taken apart. The night sky backdrop is still there. As you can see, that didn't sell, but the cardboard is uh, all lined up here. Most likely just gonna get thrown away, which is unfortunate. There's actually a Darling Dolly box. I don't think she's in there though, but look at that. There's their roof of uh, Mausoleum Row, completely unfolded and on the floor. And there it is, Mausoleum Row, completely gone. Taking a look at the dolls that are left over, we have a bunch of Devilish Desmond, which is one of the new for 2023 dolls. We have a Hugs doll, as you actually, two, or no, only one, one Hugs doll left over. Some Butcher dolls new for this year, another one of the new ones, Loving Lilith, who, again, I've had these ones since they literally came out on Amazon months ago, but they are left over here. A Pumpkin Nester doll from last year, and then Monkey Chimes, it looks like two months monkey chimes are left over at this store and then down here is a pretty funny one this is the zombie or the not zombie baby the creepy baby doll from last year which now has the uh, accidental repackaging of demonic dolly looks like there's a couple of four of them left over and then down here eerie emma so definitely a lot of dolls i cannot say again i've ever seen this amount of dolls left over for 50 percent off again pretty crazy to see the amount of stock left over for 50 percent off day ghostface sidestepper um just like the other store there's also a chucky sidestepper which my other store did not have left over but that's here the pennywise statue the popcorn statue from killer clowns and then over here another leatherface statue or sidestepper left over another ghost face some more sam ones um, um, so definitely a surplus of sidesteppers available for 50% off day. You can see some of the other small tabletop decor, the ghost face, the killer clown stuff coming over here. You can see the horror babies, the Sam, the leather face, and the ghost face left over here on November 1st. And then this is crazy to see. Pretty shocking. Look at the amount of zombie babies left over for 50% off day. Cannot say, like I said with the animatronics, I have never seen this amount of zombie babies left over on November 1st. You have Slay Time, the new version of Slay Time for this year. And then look at all the spider biter. Look how many spider biter billies are here for 50% off day. That's pretty crazy. And then two of the uh, devil cherubs. Let's see if the batteries are still working. Oh, look at that. They are. Oh, kind of working. Looks like they're dying out right now. But two devil cherubs. You have a uh, one of the zombie baby's cradles. And look at this, ladies and gentlemen. These are the uh, the pieces from Jack's mausoleum at this store. You can see the windows with the 40 pointing. I remember pointing that out at flagship, and now it's fully taken apart at this store. The roof is all disassembled. That is crazy to see. You can see the uh, Jack's mausoleum being taken apart, but look at all that remaining pieces. Cannot believe the season is already over, and next year it'll be a new ISE. But uh, there it is. The last time we will be seeing Jack's mausoleum for Spirit of Halloween, 
2023. Okay, so I'm now back at the house and I'm gonna show you my full 2023 50% off haul. First off, we have the new for 2023 animatronic activation switch. This of course is the gargoyle door knocker from the Mausoleum Row ISC. I have been, I've been wanting this for the entire season and I finally got it today on November 1st. I actually got the lab switch from last year also for 50% off day and now I got this year's switch also for 50% off. Obviously it has the Spirit Star there, has the Spirit Star there as well. I just love the look of this thing and then obviously you push on this and it activates the animatronic that you connect it to. So very glad to have finally picked this up for 2023. The next Next item that I got for 50% off was the Pretty Woman Leatherface Sidestepper, which is another item I've been wanting the entire season and finally got to pick up today. This is to go with, of course, the Pretty Woman Leatherface animatronic that Spirit came out with this year. So we'll take a quick look at him uh, right now. He is really cool. I think the look on him and detailing and everything is just really great for a sidestepper. And like I said, I've been wanting him the whole season. But then finally, my main item for the 50% off sale of Spirit Halloween 2023. Boom, right there. Like I mentioned earlier, I did pick up stilts for the 50% off haul. This was my main item. Um, the animatronic that I got this year. Very excited to have added stilts to my collection. You can see the side of the box there. This is a brand new model, as you can see, still taped up on the sides there. This is not a display or anything like that. This was brand new at my first local store, and I could not resist him for 50% off on November 1st. So there he is, still my main item from the sale. Very big box, um, as you can see there if I pull backward. But those are my items that I picked up today for 50% off. So that's gonna wrap up my Spiro Halloween 2023 50% off sale video. I am very happy with the haul that I got this year. I think all the items are very, very good. And of course, getting anything for 50% off day is so good because you save such a big amount of money. But let me know in the comments down below what you picked up for 50% off day. Obviously, it was also going on tomorrow for November 2nd, but just remember that November 2nd is the very last day that Spirit is in business, so make sure to get your last trip in to Spirit Halloween. But I guess, remember as always, for everything scary, I'm GM Haunts. I'll see you guys later for more Spirit Halloween 2023 videos. Goodbye.